Hi, I'm Dr. Zawa. Like many African Americans, Robert Coker has adult onset or type 2 diabetes. He's known so for at least 10 years now, but he's always felt fine. Diabetes is like a silent killer. You really don't get any symptoms unless your blood sugar is way up or way down. Or when complications set in, like kidney failure or a heart attack. And even heart attacks in diabetics can occur quietly without any symptoms whatsoever. That's why Robert knows he needs to be vigilant with his medications and diet. If I want to stay around here, I've got to continue to do what I've got to do. And one of the most important things diabetics like Robert need to be on is either an ACE inhibitor or an angiotensin receptor blocker. They're closely related in how they work. Well, to be honest with you, I don't know what ACE inhibitor is. So you have to explain that to me. These are drugs like Captopril, Vasotec, and Lisinopril, and others. The angiotensin receptor blockers, the ARBs, the newer kids on the block, include Atacant and Kozar, among others. One major study found 92% of diabetics had at least one of the indications for ACE inhibitor or ARB use. There's evidence now that says that all diabetics should be on this as primary prevention of kidney disease, and, and, also, and some would even argue cardioprotective as well. The drugs will lower one's risk for a heart attack, stroke, kidney failure, and death from all causes, including cardiovascular deaths. Yet research has shown that only four in every 10 diabetic patients are being prescribed the medicines. Whatever the reason, the failure to prescribe and use ACE inhibitors in particular has created a huge concern among healthcare experts. If diabetics are not aggressively treated, this is one group of patients who we need to be proactive for from the majority of the time. Proactivity is the best, I think gets us the best results. If left untreated, their diseases can be fatal or, or certainly severely disabling. Yeah, I think it's very important to, for me to look at the ACE inhibitors and that's what I'm going to do. I'm Dr. Mike Rosen.